what are we doing here? Oh, we're going over here. Man, we're overpowered as fuck. I think two slams or whatever should be able to do this guy in. Oh, he totally got me. Stop it. Ooh. I'm having the worst start. I thought I could be clever. Here we go. Oh. Oh! That's right, it is overpowered. You just gotta get in there and start working it. And not suck like I did. But even though I sucked hard, it still fucking prevailed, like, super good. Amazing. Blarg. That's creepy. Yeah, I just hate how big the chicken wing is, because it's really, like, in the way. I can't see anything. These damn colossal weapons. Yeah, but I like having the serpent bow. They said it, it's apparently like makes poison arrows more efficient or something like that. So it's great for slow killing, annoying targets. That poison can add up and pay off. Can you shoot from a uh, horseback? Yeah, right. Boom! Fuck you. Yeah, he's already poisoned. What a fucked up weapon. Ow. Just for that, you get crushed. Oh, I missed. Squish you. Yeah, that's right, I forgot. This is the best weapon in the game. The dumbass shield. Oh, what? No way. I guess the shield's kind of slow. Oh, my lock-on didn't work. Uh, can you assassinate a dude with the shield? No, I guess not. <laughs> Maybe I was just sucking. Maybe it is possible. No, you can't do it. You can't, totally can with the chicken wing. I was fucking that up though, but I'm pretty sure you can. <laughs> Alright, what do I gotta do here? I gotta defeat Rhea Lucaria lady, wizard lady in the Harry Potter town. Yeah, that fucking place. Here we go. I hate all these weird guys crawling around. What's up with that? Leave me alone, weird spooky ghost guys.
<laughs> yeah, I saw a dude who made his build so armored and tanky uh, that he was able to beat uh, Consort Redan on New Game Plus 7 without dodging or blocking, but just like straight up overpowering Redan. And he was able to do it, but guess what? Here's the catch. Took him a hundred tries. <laughs> it's not a very good vi viable build. Ow. I'm trying to get under you, fucker. Ooh, look at that damage. Ooh, the second one's even more strong. One, that's it. That's all it takes. God, that's power. Talisman that I never use really. Give me the necklace. Deal. by some prawns for now until we get the crab. In the unpatched version of the game, you just get the boiled crab straight up, and I think the boiled prawn doesn't even fucking exist, dude. So that's awesome about the unpatched version. Unless, of course, it means that uh, the defense buff is different. It's like less with boiled, boiled crab in the unpatched version, which, in which case that would be fucking lame. But I don't think it is. Um, in this version of the game, it's pretty fucking good. Trying to destroy his fucking... his food like an asshole. All right, what am I doing? All right. I would use these. They increase your damage and all, but... Nah. The negative is too great. You get like a 30% uh, health reduction, so... Oh, boy. The Gourmet Scorpion Stew. What is this? So, if I consume that, like, right now, for example, it's gone forever. That's useless. You can only use it once. You're supposed to use it at a key moment when you desperately need it in battle. Ah, oh, fuck it. Let's just use it. It's gone forever, right? Yeah, what a piece of shit item. I guess you're supposed to bu bust it out when you really need it or whatever. Yeah, I really am against games doing items like that, you know? Like, they make it so rare to the point where it's, like, pointless for its use, you know what I mean? Like, there's this th item in the game called the Golem Arrow. It's the only great arrow that's, like, worth a fuck, to be honest with you, because if you're playing online in PvP, or if you're just trying to do some really hard shots, good luck, it's next to impossible with certain distances and with lag especially online but if you have the golem great arrows those arrows have like an explosive shock wave that goes off when 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 you upon impact so even if you're slightly off like you'll hit them and they'll go flying and they'll take just as much damage and the damage is a lot 
and that bow is kick ass. And guess what? The arrows are rare as fuck, to the point where it's not even worth trying to farm them. Like, you'll never collect that much, even if you play for, like, days. Like, that sucks. Man, that sucks. So a lot of players who uh, do that shit will, like, reload their character if they can manage to farm at least, like, 50 of them. But that still takes, like, forever. And Honestly, you're, you're, you're the kind of player that's kind of a fucking dick if you're, <laughs> yeah, hoarding fucking golem arrows and constantly reloading your save just so you can use them on more and more people. Like, yeah, I have 200 golem arrows. That's a good amount. I'm going to save my character now so I can snipe you fuckers whenever I feel like it. <laughs> like, but, yeah, that's a... Guess what? In the patched version, they're, like, super hard to find. In the unpatched version, you can buy them off a of fucking vendor. Isn't that insane? So... Ho ho ho. Ow. Oh. Oh. Give me a break, bro. Squished you. Man, that squish attack is too much. It's too much, I tell you. I'll squish you all. Oh no, they're getting me. The colossal weapons are fucked up. Aren't they? Motherfucker. Yeah, this shit is too powerful. Oh my god, and I healed completely. Yeah, that talisman is pretty nice. I'm not gonna lie. What? It didn't do that much damage? Okay, it's not that effective, I guess, against this thing. That was apparently more powerful. Huh, I guess the slam attack has uh, failures in some regard. Or maybe it didn't register or something, I don't know. Survive that one, dickhead. Wow, they're all dead. Yeah, it's pretty good. It's just a sloppy weapon, honestly. Whoop-hammo! And I broke the gun. Nice. Yep, so this build is fucking nasty. Seems to be getting me through everything pretty smoothly. Not really having too much trouble. And I'm not even trying. I'm fucking around here, dude. Like, if I was trying, I would hold the fucking fingerprint shield out at all times like nope you're not gonna hit me you're not gonna hit me Yeah, I wonder how powerful that'll be on this motherfucker.
damn it. Ow. No, he got me. And Col uh, magic is my weakness. I don't have much intelligence defense. This build uh, needs to get smarter. And of course it does. Look at it. It's a really dumbass build. Dragon right on the noggin. Well, we got access to uh, Harry Potter Town. Let's go. Alright, sweet. So, yeah, this build is sloppy, and I'm not even playing good, and it's just getting me through the game like nothing. The game says while you are in combat, you are not not able to like open your map or uh, craft items. <laughs> Why can't I? Come on. Sucks, I gotta get up early. Why am I charging up? Surely they go down in one slam. They're so weak. Why am I like getting all overpowered and shit? That's so pointlessly evil. Let's just run through all this crap. Yeah, I really like this build so far. I think it's pretty much perfect. I think all it needs is more arcane, faith, and intelligence. I think might want to just get them all to 60 so I don't have to worry about it. Because the main thing is defense. You get them up there. Enemies that hit you with magic attacks, holy attacks, or... Uh, Bleed attacks or what the fuck? Hey, get out of the way, motherfucker! I'll slam your ass. Ow! The dog bit me right on the butt. Yeah, you just get better defense, and I think you get a little bit of fire defense too off of faith. I can't remember, or maybe that's strength. But I already have a good bit of strength and dexterity. 60 on each. 60 is like the golden number then. Like you reach that number, you're good. Going higher than that, it's kind of pushing it. Not really very necessary. Maybe, maybe if you really are like late game character and you're pushing it. So you're like, ah, fuck it. Dang. This 
such a fucked up weapon. Holy crap. Wow, did I just kill them both? Yeah, the power is really good. And then I can just heal once and boom, back to where I was. Yeah, it's really powerful. I don't even have to be good at dodging. There's an assassination. Man, that was violent. Heal once. Yeah, like it's really effective. Super efficient at clearing areas. Let's see if our boy will do some work here. Oh, take it easy, dog. I want you to fight the Mimic Tear. Come on, Mimic Tear, don't let me down. Uh-oh. Nice hit. Come on. Get him good with the, the move. Charge it up and s charge slam his ass. Ooh, decent hit. Ooh, another decent hit. Come on. Oh my god, you did it. Finally. Yeah, see, relying on the mimic here is very random. Sometimes it'll help you a lot. Sometimes it just fuck off and just distract you. Sometimes it's actually a bad thing because, like, it'll, it'll not do anything. It'll act really stupid. And then instead of fighting the boss, you'll be looking at the mimic here like, Man, what are you, fucking dumb? What the hell? And then the boss looks at you and kills you. And you're like, God damn it, you distracted me. By sucking. <laughs> so, that can happen. That can happen. Your mimic tier might be broken. Keep that in mind. Be ready to not solely rely on the mimic tier. Uh oh, can I make it? Oh shit. Oh. Let's see what this motherfucker's got. just kept pushing it and boy if this thing hits you hard it hits you fucking hard as shit you're gonna die I don't even have to waste a, a flask if I want it don't want to just use the healing you know look at this heal and just take one of my three uh, mana flasks. I hardly use mana flasks because I don't use a lot of magic, really. The most I'll use magic is Pest Thread Spears against certain bosses, but I still have, you know, usually one or two extras. And if things get really hairy, I'll drop one of these fucking Starlight Shards. Hell yeah, dude. Always a way to regenerate mana. Oh, or... I got the fucking talisman. If things get really hairy and I'm safe, just wait with this thing on and slowly get all my shit back. So, yeah. The build is pretty uh, foolproof. So let's uh, destroy this motherfucker. 69 shrimps. 68 now. Let's do it.
not too shabby. Damn, look at that slam hit. Uh oh. Go giant fuck. Oh, never mind. Oh no, Poochies. Smash that one dog. Let's see what you got, old lady. Slam your ass. You bitch. Yeah, she was getting away from me. This weapon's slow. It's all about charging up and then hitting them with this. They can get away. But if you pull it off, holy shit. You just took out like 40% of their health there. You know? Like, hell yeah, dude. It seems like two to three hits for a boss. Maybe less. Maybe more, depending on the boss. Yeah, I guess the fastest way uh, would be this way, yeah, I think. Fastest way to get to um, the plateau is to kill myself. Hopefully it's not too hard to do. any runes. So let's fat roll it up. Oh man, oh man. I should go to bed too, and I gotta get up early and do a bunch of stuff. Probably not. Damn it. I'm do the job proper. Ooh, three times. There you go. Man, that thing really wanted to eat my ass. There's a lot of snake shit in this game. Snakes everywhere, dude. Talisman. 
Right, I don't have a horse up here. No horse allowed in hell, right, I forgot. Take that, motherfucker. Oh! shot right there. I should use the mighty shot on the bat. This weapon doesn't seem the best for quick shotting and jump shotting and whatnot. Take that, motherfucker. Oh, got you. Fucking bitch. Hell yeah, dude. That was some lava skipping right there. That was some Super Mario fucking shit I just pulled. doing that's a dumb thing to do Slow down, I can't hit y'all. There we go. Here comes the slam, bitch. Yeah, they don't bleed though, I didn't get any bleed bonus. You can't make those fuckers bleed. Even though they have all kinds of weird organ-y goo parts. Maybe they bleed if you hit them when they're open? Uh, I don't think so. I think I would have noticed that. So that sucks, but whatever. Yeah, but I like the serpent bow. It's just the coolest thing ever. It's just it's snakes that make a bow, dude. You shoot poisonous arrows. Super fun weapon. Because honestly, the chicken wing ain't the funnest weapon. You gotta get close. You gotta pull off some lucky melee hits. They're not too hard to do, but they're they're kind of rough to pull off. So, and shields shields are boring, you know. You tank it up, it's kind of bad. Shut up, woman. Sorry, somebody using the word ascertain? I don't think so.
hell. You really went for it, didn't you guys? Oh. Nasty. That was too much for y'all. Yeah, I just don't feel like this is a good mob weapon. I feel like it's good on good at taking out one guy at a time. Maybe I should just use the shields to kill everyone. I mean, it is great. That was a, that was some fucking bullshit, right? I was really fucking that guy up. I don't even know what I'm doing. But you can't assassinate dudes with the shield. There's no criticals. I guess you just uh, just need to stop feeling like it, that's a thing you can do and just, just smash them naturally. But I like pulling off criticals. But it's kind of hard to get used to just using the shield. The bow is, though, uh, meant for certain situations. So maybe having it uh, at 3.5 isn't the way to go. I'm going to go to bed here in a sec, but maybe I can find a better combination. I shouldn't fuck with it. I should just stop sucking balls and get good. Well, in all fairness, I haven't died yet, but there have been a few close calls. 
Haha, <laughs> shot you right in the butt. Ooh. Ow. Oh, I got you again. Haha, uh -huh. I got you that time, fucker. You guys aren't doing so good, are you? Oof. Are you okay, man? No. Bonked your ass good. Gave him the most epic slammy. play this game later I guess yeah I don't think I can make this build much better it's pretty foolproof you got to be like really falling asleep or just having the worst luck ever to get killed um, but yeah I don't think I died not bad that's all I'm asking for uh, all-around build that works pretty much for every situation and I don't have to care that much or try that hard to win. I don't have to pause the game all the time and try out new gear and test this or that and wonder if this is going to be good enough. No, this build is just like, yeah, just use this. <laughs> like you got your overpowered strength, you got your distance weapon, you got your dealing with your big fucking dumb fat targets. You got the best shield in the game by a long shot to tank all the hits, basically. And of course your secret weapon, the charged up R2 attack. It's just too good. Even if they're resistant to bleed, it's pretty powerful uh, with Royal Knight's Resolve and you can just use that. But honestly, like I said, if you're going up against really big tough guys, a lot of the time pest thread spears is the way to go, or at least you like switch off between the two, you know. So yeah, there's not much that this build can't handle. Uh, I need to test it on everything in the game, of course. That's going to take forever, but pretty sure this is the most viable build. The only thing, like I said, I'm going to increase faith, arcane, and intelligence so I can have some defense and uh, maybe a few, you know, a little bit of access to some more, to some greater spells or whatever the fuck. Because uh, I might be considering using a staff so I can cast... Uh, that one spell on my shield that gives the shield like even more defense or whatever. It's like a buff that lasts like a minute or something. Uh oh, I'm getting attacked here. Ow, take it easy, dude. Ooh, you've been poisoned, bro. Ow, he cut me, that jerk. That jerk? Fuck you, dude. Can you shoot my... <coughs> oh. Choking up over here. I'm 
was gonna say, uh, can you shoot mighty shots uh, in in scope mode? <clears throat> Oh, I got butter for you. Oh, I nailed him. I nailed him. Isn't that sick? Nailed him again. And a third time. He's totally gonna die of poison. Oh, I fucking missed. Damn it, I'm sucking. Oh, I think he died. Wow, this is quite powerful. Oops, I think I killed him. Alright, we're turning Elden Ring into a shooter, dude. Oh, did I hit him? No, I missed. Uh-oh. <clears throat> Damn. The force of the arrow is pretty good. Oh well, I'm gonna go to bed. I need to go to bed. I gotta go to bed. Alright, good night.